Hi my beautiful beings! Welcome, welcome back to my channel. I'm Caitlin, and for today's video we are going to be doing a spring cleaning. I'm going to like organize my closet a little bit, um, clean out stuff from under my bed, vacuum mop, just a nice spring clean, get rid of some clothes, things like that. So let's get right into this video. Okay guys, so actually it's February right now, but I'm leaving in March to my mom's for like a month, and that's when I usually do my spring cleaning. So I just thought it'd be good to do it before I leave so that my boyfriend has a clean room while I'm gone. Um, so that's what I'm planning on doing. So right now we're actually going to start by spring cleaning my computer. I haven't backed up my computer since last June, I think. So like more than six months ago. Um, I really need to back it up so that I could keep editing on it. It has a lot of storage on there, but I just got to do that. So first we're going to do that, and then we'll move on to my closet, and then we'll move on to under the bed, and then vacuum and mop. So let's hope I can finish all of this before my boyfriend gets home from work. Start by doing my computer. This is Cody. He's just always trying to get my attention. Oh my goodness, you guys. That took like two hours. Or I don't know how long that took, actually. I don't know when I started, but it is 12.13 now. And so they're all going on there right now. I feel like really gross because I haven't had anything to eat. So I'm going to go get some water and make a smoothie. And then I'll see you guys when these are done downloading. Can you see? These are almost done. And then I will start cleaning everything else. This might take a couple days because when my boyfriend gets home, I don't really like to like do anything but hang out with him. So I try to get everything done before he gets home, but he might be home soon. So this might have to go till tomorrow. I will see you guys when we start to clean the closet. Okay, ow, now it's finally finished. I just deleted everything, I backed up everything. And thank goodness, because it feels like a big weight, hold on, a big weight has been lifted off my shoulders. Okay, so since that is done, I'm going to start on my closet. I've never shown you guys, like, my closet because it is literally a disaster. Let's turn it around. My boyfriend and I share this closet, and I get frustrated because these don't open all the way, like, my drawers. So I end up just throwing everything in this little corner right here. But here are all his clothes. And then this side is like more of like my clothes. And I switch out my clothes. So like these are my winter clothes. Once it starts to get warmer like in May, I'll probably switch out back to my summer clothes over here. Like my dresses and stuff. Um, but right now I'm just going to be focusing on this little area. And also in the drawers. I'm going to get rid of some pants that don't fit me and some shirts that I have stained with like jojoba oil and coconut oil because oil stains don't come out. Um, so I need to get rid of some of those things, make some more room. I'm not going to get rid of anything that's my boyfriend's because he needs to do that himself. But, like I would like to get rid of some shirts because he has a lot and he only wears like 10 of the same shirts. It's insane. And then those boxes down there, they're going to stay there. So then after I finish the closet and like make a bag to go donate, I'm going to show you guys the after. I'll show you guys what I'm doing like in a time lapse and then we'll move on to under my bed, which is like the biggest like mess. So let's start the time lapse. side you guys can see it looks much better here are like my big t-shirt pajamas and then these are like my boyfriend pj pants some of them are in the wash so i'll stack them up right there and then these are like my cutesy little matchy sets of pjs 
Um, and then these are his jeans and my jeans. Um, my jeans are more in the back because I don't wear them that often and I have less pairs than he does. And that's like a sleeping bag, just like a bunch of miscellaneous things that would be in a garage, but they're in my closet. So then I have my traveling pillows and my like extra blankets for my dogs and for my bed. So now I think we're gonna move on to the drawers. I'll do the drawers and then we'll move on to the mess that's over there. Okay, so I just like took everything out and like put them in piles. Was in there. These are leggings, sweatpants, like cute little pants, and these are my boyfriend's dress pants. And now I'm just gonna. Oh, and I got a couple pants that I'm going to like give away. Um, and then I have workout sets that actually go in my bathroom drawer where my workout clothes go. So I'm gonna reorganize that and then get back to you guys. Okay, guys, I did this drawer and I would show you, but you guys. Can't you can't see inside. So now I'm moving on to the second drawer, which has a lot, a lot of shirts. She is click clacking all over the floor. Yeah. So, and she's so happy. She's so happy. So here I like seamless tops, my little t-shirts, like my short sleeve t-shirts, like little cute tops that don't like, they don't match anything else in my closet, they're kind of just random. My tutu tops, and then I also have like my basic little um, tank top thingies, and then like my tighter short sleeve crop tops. So that's what I'm going to be putting in the drawer. I got rid of a couple things. And here I have like my big t-shirts that I wear like when I, like my giant ones, like my George Strait one and my Harley one and then my Sundance one. I think I'm gonna put those with my other big t-shirts that I wear um, in the closet where I showed you in the corner. And then back here I have like stuff that I'm gonna give away. And then right here on this, this is like stuff that it just, it's not where it belongs and it's like winter clothing so that I'm gonna put them in its own box. So, yeah, I'm going to put all these shirts back. And then my underwear drawer and my sock drawer are pretty organized. So we're going to move on. Okay, drawers are all done. Now I'm going to move to this section of my closet. As you can see, it's just a pile of I don't even know what. So I'm going to kind of go through it and see how I can minimalize it. So I'll show you guys like what it looks like right now. Here it is. Okay, so we still have stuff right there because it has to be there. I just tried to organize it a little bit better. Um, it's like storage stuff. And then I just picked up a little bit. I need to dust, vacuum, and mop. Those are the clothes that I'm getting rid of. And then we're going to work on like the under the bed. But we're going to do that tomorrow. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, you guys. So it's the next day and I'm going to get started. I'm going to bring the broom in because I know... I know for a fact that under my bed is so dusty and disgusting because I literally haven't touched anything down there since I moved in and it's almost been a year since then. I know that's so bad. I'm so scared. So like here's the underneath of my bed. As you can see there's like a luggage, my shoes. Those are my summer clothes and books. Ignore the dustpan. And then Bailey's kennel but under that there's like a bunch of boxes and then like we have like my boyfriend's tools we have puppy pee pads we have we have a lot of randomness that I want to organize so I'm gonna start on this side and you guys will watch that and then I'll start on this side so let's just get into it
Okay, so I finished doing my shoes and put like my high heels that I wear on like fancy occasions in a box. Hopefully in this box. I'm going to try and like fit them in there. And then these are my shoes that I wear like almost every single day. Like my Vans and then I have like my flip flops and then my Uggs will just go on the side next to there. But yeah, I'm going to finish this up and then get back to you guys when this is all cleared. But you know why? Because I freaking, whenever I start doing stuff, I like distract myself with TikTok and then I distract myself with TV. And for some reason, I am so tired. I literally think I'm malnourished. I've just been eating chips today. And I don't want to go downstairs. I really like, don't understand. Whatever. Anyways. show you guys what under the bed looks like so it's much 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 more organized everything goes all the way back and it like fits like where it's supposed to go i have my painting stuff in the front so i don't have to go through everything that was in front of it and then my boyfriend's tools are behind it like emergency tools things like that and that's just my suitcase it doesn't fit in my closet so it goes under here here it's like my workout stuff, so I don't have to keep going to the bathroom drawers to go get my workout stuff. I got rid of a lot, too. The dog's bed is right there. Those are my clothes that I'm going to switch out once it comes to summertime. My shoes and my boyfriend's shoes, and then my Uggs right there, and those are my workout clothes. It works. And I know I look crazy, guys, but this is just... I'm not putting, like, makeup on and, like, a cute outfit to clean. Like, I feel so dirty right now, so dusty. I'm going to sweep and then we're going to vacuum and then mop. So let's get to doing that. That's why I've been filming on my phone. I don't know if you guys could tell the quality difference. But now I'm going to just like start wiping down stuff with my vinegar and my rag. So yeah, cool. watch me do that. I'm almost done.
I finished finally my goodness it took like a whole two days these are all the things that I'm getting rid of from my closet and from under the bed like clothes wise and shoe wise um it's not that much but when I first moved in with my boyfriend I actually gave up a lot of my stuff so these are just things that don't fit me anymore and that I'm going to need to replace by getting new ones. So let's start with the closet. So you guys remember what it looked like before. So now everything is still there pretty much. It's just more organized, I guess. Um, yeah, there's still a lot, but it's more organized. And you can actually like see what's going on in there. And then same with this. It's all good. And now it's way more like put together this side looks good too still a lot of things but it's all in its good place here's my bed oh my gosh guys i got this i got this blanket on red bubble it's, and it is so soft and i love it it matches my bed it's so cute oh and i got a new diffuser you guys well my mom got it for me it's on amazon i think it was like 20 dollars it's a ceramic, and it works extremely well. And then my grandma recently got me this little mug. So my Nana. So yeah, I think it's super cute. They mopped and swept and dust, and I feel so much better. I feel like I'll be able to sleep on my bed better knowing that everything under there is in a good place. I hope this inspires you guys to do a little bit of spring cleaning. Maybe get rid of some stuff that you guys don't need anymore. Cleanse your space. I have oils going. I have lavender and frankincense and peppermint to just kind of clear the air, have my windows open. I just really hope this inspires you guys to maybe do your own spring cleaning. I feel like I maybe not would have done it if I wasn't making a video about it. So you guys help me get things done and it just makes me happy. So don't forget to like and subscribe. I post every Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays and go ahead and click that little notification bell so every time I upload a brand new video. And if you guys would like, go ahead and check out everything right here on the site. You guys should go ahead and type it all up, but if you can't find it, type it up. It will be linked down below for you in the description box to find. And I hope wherever you are in this world, you are having a beautiful day or night. And I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.